Okay, let me briefly explain to you what we are doing here. This is a typical setup for hands-free communication testing according to ITUT standards. So what you see here is a typical test car. We selected a tuk-tuk. Um, this is the simulation of the driver. That means it's a dummy head. He substitutes the driver. He is able to talk and to listen. This is a background noise simulation system. So it simulates the acoustical driving conditions of that tuk-tuk being on the road. And last but not least, this is the simulation of the wireless connection. So in total, this is a setup according to ITT standards to test voice communication quality in a hands-free scenario. So the tests can be carried out automatically. So with the driver, the simulation of the driver, he can talk into the microphone of a hands-free system or he can listen what is transmitted from the loudspeaker. And the idea is to test and ensure sufficient voice communication quality according to ITUT standard. This goes for P1100, narrowband communication, P1110, that's wideband communication, but also for eCall, which is P1140, which is an upcoming issue now for safety reasons. Another topic which is offered by ITU during this uh, event here is the third speech quality test event for mobile phones in conjunction with car hands-free systems. ITUT hosts a white list of mobile phones which behave completely transparent in combination or in conjunction with a car-mounted hands-free system. And the, the possibility or the offer of ITU is to test mobile phones here on the go, that means on site and to get phones listed in the whitelist, which is a proof that these mobile phones behave completely transparent and are absolutely okay in conjunction with vehicle-mounted hands-free systems.